How do we do this again? It has been quite some time. The hair is curly. Sarah is still beautiful. Lost a few pounds, hopefully. Quarantine life. We haven't vlogged since like early March. Yeah. We did a lot of stuff. We got married religiously. <laughs> um, still waiting for the next one, the big Persian one. Stay hopefully tuned. Hopefully 2021 goes as good. Countdown begins. And I gave birth to baby Chai. The newest member of our family. Say hello to everyone. Hi. Hi. She has been a joy and a terror in our lives. Can't imagine life without a little baby puppy anymore, especially her. I gotta give a shout out to Sarah. She tried like for four months, called 70 different dog breeders, oh. and finally found our little girl. So New York City, outdoor, you can eat. Sarah and I have not had a brunch in since, I don't pre even know. Yeah, pre-corona. So. We decided to pick up the camera, go to brunch, show the city a little bit, walk around. We're going to like a spot we went to maybe a year or two ago, maybe yeah. two years ago. It's so good and like such a cute area. And we've like, talked about it since we've gone. Like yeah. every day, like, oh, we have to go back. We have no, to go we back. Just haven't, because the area is kind of far. It's like downtown west, it's like West Village. It's so cute. The area is so cute and the place itself, it's called Hudson Clearwater, so if you're ever in New York. Say you're done with that on your face, girl, it just don't show. When you're ready, just say you're ready. When all the baggage just saying it's heavy and the party's over, just don't forget me. We'll change the pace and we'll go slow. You won't ever have to worry. You won't ever have to hide. Running madly. It's 1038. The reservations for 10:30. Excuse my eye, by the way. I'm not dying. I just woke up and it's red and itchy, but pretty sure it's fine. So we just put in some clips of what your typical Sunday now looks like in New York City, in the Upper East Side. The seatings outside are taking over. It looks like a little Europe now. So if you've ever visited Europe, it's literally outdoor seating central that take over the streets. Here in New York, they only have a license as of now to take up part of the street until Halloween. I don't know if Cuomo is going to allow indoor seating after that or what's going to happen, but it's getting crazy. It's not just outdoor seating though. It's not like they just put some table, they really. cabanas, they put walls in between, they Palm put trees. decorations. Yeah. yeah. I'm sure the restaurant we go to right now is going to have. Ours has a patio, Ooh. so it's not like they're not, they didn't have to wor worry about renting out the sidewalk or the street but um, when i looked at the photos it looked like it was in the back unless that's new so it's crazy though like your favorite chinese takeout spot has outdoor seating now like nice outdoor seating here to go pizza outdoor seating, outdoor seating baby. <laughs> life has become very weird in new york this is why we don't really vlog because we don't really do anything we, we don't go shopping anymore we don't go out to eat a lot of cooking from home. It's a lot of taking care of the freaking poopster over here. Yeah, our lives have changed, not just because of Corona, but having a little puppy that you gotta take with you everywhere. And like literally we have a little baby bag for her. We like take her lunch, we take her snacks, we take her potty pads, her water, her toys. <laughs> like we look like a freaking new parents. Like We're the most like, stylish parents you've ever met. <laughs> Seen all my mistakes, so love me in my eyes. You having fun, Mom? You having a good nap? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, Broadway is like dead. Like, dead. Like, I remember back in the day, like a year ago, <laughs> um, not even that, like eight months ago, like, my mom would come visit, like, anyone would come, they'd be like, Let's go to Broadway on Soho, like, because that's where all the nice stores are at, like, portable, expensive, luxury, whatever, like, you got such a big range. All these cute little restaurants, matcha, nail salons, it's like dead. Well, the main Broadway, but like, if you go off streets, it's a little better, but a lot of stores have closed and it's kind of sad. Driving through Broadway every day since Sarah works near Soho Tribeca. I work on Canal. You really see the impact that COVID's made because a lot of these big names are closed, <laughs> they're gone, like restaurants closed, gone. It's crazy. <laughs> what? The guy's like, what the fuck are these people doing? So she has a car seat 
but of course I baby her and this is where she goes. Cheyenne doesn't really like it, but he chooses his dad. <laughs> Hopefully you guys can hear me. Baby girl got tired. She's over it. We tried walking her and she was just like mm -hmm. Now we're just exploring the West Village. We'll see where the day takes us. To, Cause you don't say you love me to your friends when they ask you Even though we both know that you do You do one time, been in love one time You and all your girls in the club one time I was so convinced that you're following your heart Cause your mind don't control what it does sometimes We all have our nights I think the best oh, thing to do on a Sunday like this Is just to walk around and explore we Got no plans, got nowhere to go So let's just see what we find I'm Taking hella photos Sarah's getting mad annoyed at me I'm not getting annoyed at you, I'm getting So ashamed of Had mine, you've had yours We both know, we know Thing that we haven't done in quite some time. We're gonna walk into a store and see what's popping in there. <laughs> We're gonna do some shopping. It's been too long. Everything I see, I warned Sarah that this was gonna happen. You know what Sarah's doing? Walking five feet ahead of me, annoyed as hell. Beeps. <laughs> I think I sweat that much. Yes! We finished our day in the West Village. Ooh. Sarah's breaking in her new Stan Smith. She has a scab. Traveled, walked around the West Village, got shit ton of photos. New photos are coming. Tell them about the store you found. Ooh, you found the store. Yeah. Sarah walked, well, you know, the great thing about New York is that there's all these little boutiques. Little one-offs that you don't really know. You don't. They're not. They're like mom and pop-ish shops. Yeah, you gotta support them. Support your local people. So we walked into a store. They had a great sale. Your boy cop two pairs of pants. Been dying for some pants because all I have are jeans. The sale was the two pants itself was over two hundred dollars. We got two pants. Sarah got two masks because she's trying to swag out with the mask, match, coordinate with her outfits. All under a hundred dollars. Wild. She showed me the price. I was like, holy crap. It's not a day out until we hit our spot. I gotta go to CVS and get band-aids. That's not the spot. What's the spot? Cha-cha matcha. Cha-cha matcha! Yeah! Came to Soho. Sun's coming back out. We didn't film it. Yeah, we did. We went to, um, what's it called? Mason Kitchen. They have really cute stuff and they have a good sale going on so now we're off to explore Spring Street. Don't know what we're gonna look into but we'll, we'll show you guys around the way. OGs remember this. It used to be all construction when we look books here. We can't leave now. <laughs> Day is never complete unless Sarah buys something as well. We both got our cops. Nice cops. Worth it. It was well worth it. Look at you, girl. Look at you, girl. 
Who's a cute girl? I'm coming, mom. I'm coming. <laughs> I think Charlie has spoken for us all. It's time to go. I'm closing it out. We will talk to you guys later. See us on the next video. Bye. <laughs>